Right here. We hit, hit, hit. Rockets explode around the position held by anti Qaddafi fighters. We were forced to evacuate the area. The attack by Qaddafi loyalists was a counter-offensive to prevent them from losing control of areas south of Sirte. But the fighters of the National Transitional Council pushed on, securing kilometers of territory leading to the city's airport. This time, they say, they will hold this position. It is part of their strategy to isolate Qaddafi's hometown. The airport itself is not strategic, but it is the location. Gaddafi's forces used to control the southern outskirts of Sirte. From here, they used to fire heavy weapons at their opponents. It is not only that. The airport is close to Abu Hadi, a neighborhood where loyalists are holding out, a neighborhood where civilians are trapped. My family is trapped in Sirte. I haven't had any communication with them for two months. Gaddafi's men are not letting their opponents out, and I fear for their safety. But Gaddafi also has support. Fighters have been firing rockets at the city to try to weaken the enemy's defenses. It has been two weeks since anti-Gaddafi fighters launched their first assault against Sirte. There have been many battles since, but fighters say this one has brought them closer to their goal. This paves the way for the final phase. We have separated Gaddafi fighters in search from those in Abu Hadi, and we are closing in on them. These fighters are now besieging this coastal city. They say that soon they will take Sirte. Senna Khudr, Al Jazeera, Sirte.